Good morning, folks. The plasma filaments leading on the south are looking a bit sparse and spread. Meanwhile, behind the Earth scale, we've got a bigger one incoming. Solar wind appears relatively stable over the last 24 hours. The BZ is still dipping south, but thus far the KP index shows Earth's shield is holding quite well. Pretty wild cosmic ray fluctuations the last three days. Nothing huge, just a lot of up and down. There were no major solar flares, but an uptick certainly showed up. Low level flashing at the big group and the eastern limb, multiple C flares. Big sunspot group is the only one worth analyzing today, and even it has lost a good deal of interaction. Just a big lug with a tiny bit of mixing potential near the negative trailing spots. New ones coming in up north. Mercury and Venus almost lined up. Northern positive coronal hole here beginning to face Earth. We're already seeing an uptick in New Zealand, two above average tremors. This is the X-ray flashing of the center of our galaxy. It flares and X-rays just like our sun. NASA is reporting that there have been recent increases in flare activity there that reach up to 400 times the normal background flux. The galaxy likely also releases a CME type megawave of particles, but that would take millennia to get here and would be very spread out. We're also seeing a story about the remnants of a much larger ancient eruption. It's pushing particles out at 2 million miles per hour, as fast as the fastest CMEs. Another Great Lakes ice update here. We've now jumped up over 10% coverage and we'll keep checking in as this major cold front is sweeping through. The west is a kind sharing place and they've let the east borrow their cold spell this week. Warmer in western Canada than in parts of the Gulf states. That's fun. More snow and ice in the forecast. In Europe, the main convergence line crests the UK and Ireland and then heads up to Norway and Sweden. Got another low in Turkey. That's where the purple is, following the lows and the convergence. Got a pretty big low in northwestern Australia that draws latitudinal convergence back east, aided by the warm moisture flow from south of Indonesia. Thunderstorm warnings persist as they have. Mobile Observatory is in Tucson, Arizona today. Phoenix on the 11th. Time and locations for all events can be found at observatoryproject.com. You've got your current conditions and shots of our star to close. It's 6.30 a.m. Eastern Time, 4.30 a.m. in Arizona. That's the news. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.